Pretty dodgy, mate. I reckon the government's not telling us something. Bloody catspiracy, if you ask me. If a dog owner dies in the house and the body's left in there, the dog won't even go near it. They're loyal pack animals, you know. A cat, a cat on the other hand, will start devouring the decaying body. And sometimes they don't even wait until you're dead. Clyde and I have always been close. We're always doing crazy things. I knew from the beginning he was destined for greatness. Yeah, um, then I came out to my own roof as being able to talk. I was pretty nervous, you know, but in the end it was easy. It just sort of slipped out naturally, like childbirth. <laughs> Why don't you try a harmony? Yeah, she took it really well. So I used to live with this amazing Austrian family, the Fingerschlofs, but they were thinking of getting a dog. So I killed them. It's fine that one of them was a ginger, and later I found out that. Two of them were wanted sex offenders. When their bodies were found, I was adopted by Ruth. It's not that I hate her. Hate is a really strong word. It's more that I wouldn't be upset if she were eaten by sharks or if she was punched in the face, drowned in a pool of her own tears, or she was, you know, overdosed on catnip or something like that, or drowned in an aquarium. It's just a constant chain of condescending baby noises and comments stating repetitive things. You're a little kitty kitty kitty, you're a yes, kitty. And you're a human. This is a fun game. I know he can be a bit of a handful, but deep down, he's a sweetheart. Every Thursday night he comes into my bedroom while I'm sleeping for a little cuddle. He can be so affectionate. Ruth is about to take a bath. I'm a talking cat. I just want some intellectual stimulation. This is my wall of inspiration. We have uh, Pussy Boots, uh, Grumpy Cat, Robert De Niro, he's fun. Uh, Simba Garfield, who doesn't hate Mondays. Uh, Mr. Bigglesworth, Mao Zedong, Kim Jong-un, Ricky Martin. Sometimes I like to pretend that they're in love. Have you found the neighborhood dogs? <sighs> oh God, it's coming over here. Dogs are the scum of the earth. Ah. I think we should go another path. <laughs> Uh, this is oh. a says a hierarchy that exists. Cats, Austrians, the Kardashians, other humans, dirt, fleas, flea dirt, politicians, and zen dogs. Does that answer your question? Now that you've come out to your owner, so to speak, what do you want to do? Well, there is one thing I want to do. 
We're about to get a baby Chino. I have a feeling it's going to be amazing. I overheard this little boy talking about this baby Chino. This fluffy cup of cloud milk. And I knew then and there it was something I needed to have. We're here on Brunswick Street. It's amazing, there's so many trendy people. Come on. Oh, it's... is that a cat? It is! I love it. <laughs> I'm nervous, but at the same time I'm also a little bit aroused. It's kind of like I'm sexualizing it, like it's, it's like a goal of mine, it's like a life goal. You know, I, I'll post it on Facebook, like, you know, when like mothers post about their children on Facebook. That's for me, but it's a baby chino. This teensy cup of cloud milk cost me nine dollars. But it was totally worth it. I'm supposed to be on a diet. So I saw this show last night called um, Man vs. Wild and it really hit me, you know. What am I doing with my life? So I decided to leave the nest in search of life experience. I just think Cats have become too reliant on comfort, you know? Everything is available for us, and we don't really have to try very hard. It's time to take off my little kitty booties and put on my big cat booties. I mean, if Bear Grylls can spend the night in a camel's carcass, then you know anything's possible. I'm not scared. Beautiful, isn't it? Time to go. Yep, got it. Thank you. It's time to go! Freedom is overrated. Ruth bought me a fake dog to teach me about responsibility. It is the bane of my existence. Come on, Jeremy! I'm a talking cat. <laughs> That's salt. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're not doing the hand thing because it actually doesn't look like you do yeah. the hand thing. <laughs>